Welcome back to 30 games. You can call me Phoebes or Phoebe, and today you and I are diving into Baby Blue's Nightmare. All I know is that we're playing as a toddler, probably in a horrible situation, so <laughs> let's go ahead and start a new game. You can examine items by pressing Q. Oh. <sighs> Already a baby or toddler sobbing sound. That's a great, <laughs> that's a great way to start. Sure. Sure. Let me tell you a little story about a little boy named Aiden. Aiden was a very, very special boy. He was a bit different than the other kids around his age. Did y'all see those Instead toys? The other kids, he loved to play with his toys. Is well, my mom Chico? The kids chose the most beautiful <laughs> dolls to play with. Aiden, on the other hand, used to ask all the time why the ugly dolls always get in. Well, only the beautiful ones get the most attention. So Aiden loved to collect the least beautiful dolls so they don't feel left out. Aiden always felt sad when she was being left out. He wanted to be kind to everyone, despite their looks. Aiden was obsessed with a show called Red Belly and Friends and collected all its dolls, except Red Belly himself. Because even though Red Belly was the nice looking one, he was always mean to the other dolls. Aiden didn't like when someone was mean to others. He had Kitty Paws, Mr. Bunny Tea, Miss Starry, Honey Claw, and Cloudy Head. He always wanted them to sleep next to him because they made him feel safe. The real monsters wouldn't come near him because the dolls were his protection. Aiden never went anywhere without them. Oh yeah? Everywhere he went, he took them with him. They're so he cute. Every one of them. Until one day, they were gone. Maybe it was the work of Red Belly, the nicest one among the group. Because sometimes, the real monsters come in a nice way and with a friendly face. Are we gonna have to fight Mr. Red Belly? Good night. All right. So I, you know. Okay. We have a happiness meter, a health meter, a stamina looks like as a toddler, even though I'm pretty sure we're just going to be toddling around. Um, I said that Aiden collected the ugly dolls. Um, I'm not sure if those would really be considered ugly. They were really well designed. Even beautiful, you may say, you know, um, t t beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Five behind all of your five protective dolls. Okay. Um, but th they were definitely terrifying, scary. I don't know. I don't know, Aiden. Um, is that really how you feel? Or is that just what your mama Shigo tells you? Because uh, if Shigo's our mama, a lot would make sense. Also, just my, my wiggle. <laughs> My room! <laughs> wow. Guys, I need to start looking at things as a toddler. Hmm. I've definitely seen some of these toys before in another game I've played. Oh, that's cute. We can jump. Pretty good stamina for a child. Oof. What about you? Are you one of my scary ones? You might be. I don't know. No? <laughs> my little toddler shadow. Okay. All right. Oh, is this my drawing of Mr. Redbelly? Huh. So I feel brave with my five friends against Mr. Redbelly. If Redbelly is the nicest, why do I hate him? Because he's not nice to my toys. Mm. Oh. Do I get to equip the sword? No. It's cute that I have a little pirate theme going on here. Pirate poster, pirate bed, a little sword. Hello? Hmm. Oh, I bet you're one of my monsters. Can I throw another doll at you? I bet I can. No? The, disori this, the disorientation on this game is real. Let's try again. Because it just seemed to go right through my friend there. I, you were one of them that was looking at me creepily on the bed. Hello? Can I leave my room? D 
Do I want to leave my room? Oh. Hmm. Yeah, I've definitely seen these toys before. Especially... Hello? But store me out! Oh. Mr. Bear, are you haunted by the argument too? Mom, Dad. Find a way to unlock the main baby gate. All right, mom and dad are uh, arguing. We're just gonna ignore them. We're gonna grab my little toddler stool. Yeah, it's on loop. That sounds about right. I'm a tall toddler. Oh. Oh, that's Mr. Redbelly. Some objects can also be moved around to reveal passageways. Ooh, Mr. Redbelly, are you hiding a passageway? I really hope we don't have to see Mr. Redbelly, but um, I understand if we do, I guess. <laughs> He's gonna be the big bad, right? Big scary guy. Hi, are you one of my disgusting toys? Hmm. Uh, Mr. Redbelly, I already turned you off. Oh, this is as fast as I can run, of course. Toddler legs. Do I have to use my stool to grab all my toys? I guess that would make sense. My little little baby legs. Hello! Rabbit. Terrifying rabbit. No? Hi. Nothing? I can't grab you? You're one of the creepy ones. Yeah, I can't grab you either, can I? Oh, I have to... Says I have to find my friends, but my friends are <laughs> not out within reach. I guess I just gotta clear the way to crawl an event. Why wouldn't I? Sure. Hello. Oh, oh. What am I doing? Oh. oh yeah, a rat. A mouse. Come here, Mr. Mousey. Oh. Hmm. This must be mom and dad's room. Crowns allow you to draw on some walls and get creative. <laughs> yes! Hello? Mr. Redbelly! Is that you? Huh. I better move this couch. It's blocking the door. You can open cabinet doors to climb on them and reach new heights. <laughs> Throw the glue, make the mess, and the shampoo. Ooh, a key. 
picked up the main baby gate key. Yes, mom, dad, guess what? Can I open this? Hello? Hello? Mr. Redbelly, are you under the bed? Hello? Hmm. This is a strong, spray painty sounding crown. Nice. All right. We've got the main baby gate key. Now we can go see mom and dad fighting. Mr. Redbelly. Oh, hello. I know you're here. Ah! I don't want to look up. Hello? Hmm. Hmm. A pig. Are you calling me a pig, Mr. Redbelly? Well, you're a pig, fatso. Also, why are y'all watching TV? Oh, who drew a, who drew a frowny face on my painting? Which one of you did it? How dare you? How dare you? We're gonna we're gonna redraw this. Happy. Happy. Make it happy. Make it happy. Of course it won't. Fine. Whatever. Okay. Hmm. All right. Mom. Dad. Mr. Redbelly is acting up again. You're crying. Enemy knows your location, even if you hide. When scary events occur, your cry mirror will drain. If it goes low, you will start to cry. What happens? Why am I crying? The enemy will know my location? Even if I hide? What kind of sick game is this? My dolls. Okay. Hello? Oh, what am I, where am I supposed to go? Mom? Dad? Where... Where is everybody? Front door? My parents aren't being very mindful. Oh no. Well, how do I get my happiness up? Yeah? Yeah? Ah. Uh, use. Heck yeah. Chocolate bar restored my happiness, so I'm no longer crying. Let's take another one. We'll need it. Mom. Dad. Let's crawl behind. Oh. No. Mom? Dad? I don't like this game. I don't think that's wine. I don't know if that's really wine. Oh no. Oh no. Why, 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 why? Why would I... Why would I follow the blood trail? The wine trail, the blood trail. It's blood. Blood. There was a stool back in the room. Do I have to? Hello? Oh no, that's a lot of blood. Oh no. That's a lot of blood. Oh! That's a lot of blood. Oh no, I didn't go downstairs. What? No, I should have gone downstairs. Damn it, now I'm trapped. What? What? Oh no. I guess we could try again. Oh.
Okay, we're going downstairs. Oh no. <gasps> uh, is that Mr. Redbelly? Where all the blood is. Yeah, I guarantee it. Oh, black void. Oh. Oh my god. Why would I choose to play this game? This is terrifying. Hi, Mr. Redbelly. <laughs> You're disgusting. Mom? Dad, did you murder someone, Mr. Redbelly? Please don't get up. Oh god, he's up. I guarantee you he's up. Hello? Oh. Mom? Dad? Oh, I don't want to go that way. I can't run. Okay! Uh, yeah, this is, um, just got dark real quick. Real quick. Can I grab any of these tools? Nothing. Key. Front door. <laughs> Front door key. Oh, the clowns are following me. Guys, what are we doing here? I'm a toddler. Ew, now you're looking at me. F*** off, all of you. Okay, I have to make it back to the front door. Yeah? Is this the way you want me to go? Oh! I think mom got murdered, y'all. I think... I think she got murdered. I think my mom got murdered. I think... I think I'm gonna... get another candy bar. And get the hell out of here. Oh my god. Hi, Mr. Redbelly. Oh god. I'm gonna start crying, y'all. Everything's so loud. Everything is so loud. Ah! What am I supposed to do? <laughs> Mr. Redbelly is making a mess of our house. And my mom and dad are nowhere to be found. Oh gosh, this got dark real quick. Hello? Nope. Front door, front door, front door, front door, front door. We're leaving. Oh gosh, we're not, we're not done. We're not done. We're not done. Why aren't we done? Why aren't we done? Why aren't we done? Oh no. This is messed up. Uh, my tricycle? My tricycle? Oh, okay. Gotta open the garage door somehow. Is that what you're telling me? Oh, no. Hello? Okay. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Buddy, I need you to waddle as fast as you possibly can, please. Please, 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 please. Ride. Yeah, we're riding our tricycle. Oh, oh, oh. God, the clowns. Why are the clowns here? Oh, are we sure? Oh, no. Mom? Mom? Ah! Okay. 
That was very well done. Baby Blue's Nightmare is a horror game created by one developer. Please submit any feedback. Great game for one developer. Very intense. Great game. Um, but also that was stressful. It's just so hard for me to play games, especially like putting your, like putting your, forcing us, the player, into this perspective as, as, a, as a toddler. <sighs> that was the basement. Oh, Mr. Redbelly. Oh. I would love to know what you think of Baby Blue's Nightmare down below in the comments, what you thought of this perspective, but thank you so much for making it to the end of the video. While you're here, make sure to hit that subscribe button. You can call me Phoebes or Phoebe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!